Hello everyone! It's strawberry time in the completionist farm. After yesterday's episode, I realized that strawberries are totally still possible because it's only the third of spring today. They'll still have lots of time for growing and I think you have a three day grace period with strawberries. Whatever the case, we're going to throw my existing ones through the seed maker. And today it's even raining, so that helps. I don't have to water anything because I'd want to water them right away to make them work. So how many do we have? We have 24 strawberries. Going to throw the ruby in the bin before I forget because there's another one on the way. So these 24 should turn into about 40, maybe a little better, depending on how good they do. That might depend on luck for the day. No, don't eat it. Put it in the bin. All right, those should be ready to go pretty quick. Let's go take a look at where we're actually going to put these. Uh, we should actually have enough room pretty much right there, depending on a few other factors. So we'll start hoeing while we're waiting. All right, they already popped. Let's go flip them. I realize too that rainy days are kind of a double-edged sword these days because when it's raining I don't have to water anything, which normally isn't a big deal because I don't water much anymore, but my truffle hunters don't come out of the barn to hunt truffles so I don't make any money off the pigs. Alright, I'm uh, not sure if that's going to be enough for the strawberries yet, but we're going to find out soon enough. Uh, wrong button again, gotta left click for this, left click for the seed makers. Uh, let's go take care of the animals while we're waiting for that to happen. Pretty sure my chicken is going to need to be fed because he's inside for the first time in a while. We'll just one by one it until he's got four. That way that should get him pretty much all the way through spring because we shouldn't have too many more rainy days than that. And good chicken. He's disgruntled. I don't care. I've already gotten the eggs. Today we can also get the duck feather. That way we can get the uh, community center done. And there was something else I wanted too. Oh, a duck and a rabbit. I think I need an upgraded coop for that though, to be honest, now that I think about that, because I think that's a basic one. So we'll maybe start the upgrade for that today if we can. Oh, I'm going to be just shy of seed makers. Oh, I shouldn't use the gold quality ones then. That's okay. We'll pretend that didn't happen. And then we'll start planting away. I'll make a lot of money off these crops this year. And finally, the final ones. Do, do, do. Those go in there. Uh, one, two. And we're left with still another 23 strawberry seeds. That's lots. I didn't actually expect it to be this many, so that's awesome. These will make me a lot of money throughout spring, and all I gotta do is wander by and pick them up once in a while. I even need one more sprinkler. Awesome. Uh, I'm gonna go get the sprinkler before I lay those out, because I have a habit of doing that wrong. Now, I got eight more still, so I could plant still a whole bunch more things, because I still have more sprinklers on top of these, too. I'm just not gonna right now. Uh, we'll keep it kind of uniform because it doesn't really matter at this point. Actually, that would have been more than enough. Well, there you have it. Some very evenly planted strawberries. A few over there. We'll pretend those don't exist because I know how everyone's going to say something about those. All right, let's go check with Robin and see what it's going to take to build a bigger coop. I think we'll just go ahead and take some hardwood and wood and stone right now, just in case that is some of the stuff we need. Is that really all the wood I have? I've got to have more somewhere. If not, I can just buy it if I have to, but... I don't know what it involved in making a bigger coop. We'll find out. Where's my horse? A lot of this really was this sort of stuff I should have been doing throughout winter. Upgrading the coop, uh, buying extra animals, all that stuff. I don't even have my axe on me. It's a roadblock, Kate. Horse, I'm going it alone from here. But because winter, I just really wasn't into it anymore because winter is just so repetitive, I just didn't even think about anything. But that's okay. We'll get it all done this year. Most of it anyway. I don't think everything because there's still actually a lot to do. I should probably still buy more seeds from Pierre's, that way I can plant the rest of everything. But we'll get to that. So, farm buildings. So the big coop takes 400 wood, 150, and then 10,000. Okay, we could totally do that, we just gotta buy some wood. As long as it's not super expensive. I've gotta have more wood back at the farm somewhere, don't I? I can't have used it all. I don't even know what I would've used it all on, maybe my house upgrade. If I only have 24 wood, then something is wrong. We'll go get my axe and go on a chopping spree. I'm pretty sure we can cut that all in one day, provided my axe is of adequate level. And it is gold quality, so that's not too bad. Uh, let's check for wood real quick though. Where did it all go? All right, well, confirmed. I have a whole bunch of hardwood, but no regular wood. So let's go down to the woods and start chopping down trees, provided they don't have any tappers on them. And that was just the basic coop, so all I can get right now are basic animals. I need upgraded to get the upgraded. And, oh, we have Shane in a blackout stupor. I should just roll him off the edge ever so gently. No one will ever know. And he's even throwing up. We're not going to watch this. We've seen this one before. If you want to see that, go to the Shane marriage vid somewhere there. I, I did cover that at some point. I don't remember where, really. Anyways, tree chopping time. At least I have the gold axe. I would have been really mad doing this with the basic. When you start the game, I know it's really hard. You initially have to gather, I think, 300 to 350 wood for the bridge down at the ocean. 
but later in the game you have a lot more energy and your axe is a lot more efficient because it takes less chop so it's not actually going to be that hard to get the wood i'm already up to 150 and i barely broken a sweat i have however just come to the conclusion that i'm not going to make it back to the carpenter shop by the time i get my wood because it's already four o'clock i'd have to leave almost now to make it in time because they close at five but that's okay i'll have wood for tomorrow and they should be open tomorrow why aren't you hitting anything maybe real quick we'll check with marnie just in case we can get one more creature for the coop i really don't think we can but i've been wrong before so might as well check before we run out of time oh okay apparently i've been cutting all the trees down through here they're just not growing back i can't think of when i cut all the trees down maybe they really actually do take a long time to grow back because there is like none left except for this guy i must have come through here and cut all the wood i can't remember when though might have been my house upgrading adventure but i mean i'm up to 306 wood for now and that's actually a big step in the right direction i'll go cut whatever trees are left out there in the world and i might just have to buy the rest again not the end of the world i just didn't want to spend the money right now because the coop itself is going to cost ten thousand gold now where's my stupid horse i know he's right here somewhere i'm not going to cut down too many of those even because they're just not really worth it where's my horse okay whatever the horse is going to be a free range horse for the rest of the day i'm going to go to the beach see if there's anything worth foraging there on this rainy spring day and then move on along all right so far so good if only the beach is all covered like this sea urchins corals all iridium quality sometimes two at a time there's my marriage friend but he's not going to give me anything today because i'm already married unfortunately i did this hoe up an ornamental fan hey i don't even have that yet that's actually a brand new one had no idea i didn't think i could really get anything more because i've been hoeing this whole time so cool that's one more and that's really one of the amazing things about this game i've played it this long even as completionist farm i put a ton of hours into shut up clint and i can still find new stuff and it still surprises me that's how good this game is, how deep it is. Uh, red mushroom. No, I'm not going to the desert. Not for you, Sandy. Basically through everything in there, I'm going to keep the fan right there. What's going to annoy me until I donate it. Uh, going to keep the resources out. You're going in there. You're going in there. Tools I need. You're going in there. And you can hang out in there too. Why not? All right. Put the axe back where it's supposed to go. And I think I'm going to bed because I don't know what else I would do today. I forgot I have a beehive down there. I should plant some flowers next to it and get some honey. Hey, Leah's still up painting. Gonna make some money with this one? I made a little wood sculpture today, but it was so ugly I threw it into the fire. Aw, you should have done that with the one you made me. So our money for spring the second isn't gonna be great, but it's still 1635 gold. Again, that's not bad for me just running around because it was raining, but by the end of spring, I'll be making a ton of money. Raining again today, so no truffles, yay. Another completionist episode down. Oh, suddenly we're getting all the Shane Hart events. Probably because there's no more snow on the ground. Anyways, that's going to be it for this one. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time.